The following review has been approved by Ethel the Cyborg Ninja. Hey there, how you guys doing? This is Mark from Classic Game Room coming to you from the Intergalactic Space Arcade. And you know, people always ask me, Mark, how is Classic Game Room made? How do you make video reviews? Well, let me show you the magic behind the camera. This is how Classic Game Room is produced. The first thing I do in the morning is I come in and do paperwork because it's a real business after all. <laughs> Jesus the coked up chicken, he's high on space coke. Jesus is high on space coke. Do, 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 do. Now that that's done, I'm gonna check my schedule because I think I've got some video game reviews to do. Right. Okay. Alright. The game I'm reviewing today is called Aqua Venture on the Atari 2600. This is an old game with bad graphics. I give it a 2 out of 10. This this just isn't working for me. I need to pick me up. Oh look! There's only one beer left! Derek! What now? Can I have help opening a bottle? I don't know how this works. It's... Look at that. Look at that. Now can you pour, pour it in there? Um, in a dramatic fashion? Yes. Yeah, yeah, slow motion if possible. Delicious beer. That was seriously the worst on camera pour ever. Did. <laughs> you fail at on camera beer pouring. Hey, Mark. I loved you in Stargate. You were great, man. That was awesome. Cheers, Derek. Go back to doing some some um whatever it is you do. Over I don't here. I don't know really. I can't can't. Who's to say? But you know, here's the thing. Yep. Actually, I forget. Never mind. Okay. Take two. Aqua Venture on Atari Twenty Six Hundred. Your objective in this game is to repopulate the species of hot mermaids. After assaulting sea creatures with laser beams and robbing them of their priceless treasure. So what I do now is I take that audio track that I just recorded and drop it into the timeline. Right next to my opening sequence. And the gameplay is Aqua Venture on Atari 2600. Sort of. It was actually unreleased, but it's an awesome game. Take two, Aqua Venture on Atari 2600. Your objective in this game is to repopulate the species of hot mermaids after assaulting sea creatures with laser beams and robbing them of their priceless treasure. That one's a keeper. I'm gonna go mess with people. Dick! You know, like, like, am I gonna make it? Can I just get to that next health pickup? Will I ever see Michelle Pfeiffer? I'm telling you, I enjoyed this game. Like, way more than the Genesis version. It's not much. It's, oh, God. What did I do now? I'm trying to record the review. You successfully helped Ethel the Cyborg Ninja get funded on Kickstarter. I did. I'm basically responsible for it. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> hey, you got, some, you got some new toys over here. Yeah, I did. Please don't touch them. X-Files toys. Cool. Hey, my name's Agent Mulder. What's up, Scully? Feel the tension in the air? Oh, hello. Hello, Fox. Um, no, I, I'm afraid I don't feel much of anything, really. That's strange. You have an English accent. Oh, that is strange, considering I'm from Michigan. Wonder how that happened. Hmm. Oh well, shall we get on with it? Oh. No! David Duchovny, you're cheating on me! Oh, how dare you! Shut up, Derek! I have a restraining order against you anyway! Don't, Bitch! Don't call it a restraining order. It's a love letter. You and I both know that. I can't talk right now, I have a meeting at the UN! 
Cool. <laughs> Fly away. <laughs> What's the shelf blocking your path? Cool. <laughs> She's like the rocketeer or something. I'm a very bad wizard. <sighs> oh no! Emma Watson has hit herself on the head and apparently knocked herself out. What should make- oh, wait, what's this? David Duchovny and Gillian Anderson are making out. Next to a cadaver. This is all very normal for a classic game room. Yes, yes, this is how the X-Files really ends. With Mega Man getting in on the action. Hello, woo! Brandon! Brandon! Ethel the Cyborg Ninja was successfully funded on Kickstarter. And you know what that means, don't you? No. You promised to smile on camera. Are you sure? Positive. Smile! Smile time. Think happy thoughts. Think Jar Jar. Making a guest appearance in a Pokemon game. How awesome would that be? Come on. Is that how you do it? Smile. No. If you smile, I will beat Derek in the head with the GameCom again today. Oh, there you go. Thank you. Bye. I didn't hate it. Mark's right behind me, isn't he? This one is from Brandon. <laughs> As you can see, it's not all just fun and games around here. It takes a lot of work and professionalism to make... Oh, look who it is! It's one of the new clone marks from the new film I'm working on! Come on in! Come on in! Yo, what's up, producer Mark? This is Sega Genesis fanboy Mark, and you know I'm bringing the blast processing! I'm just gonna go out on a limb and assume you've been playing Sega Genesis. You know I'm rocking 16 bits on my Sega Genesis because Sega fanboy Mark does what Nintendo don't! I got blast processing! Woo! <laughs> Alright, man, catch you later. Well, that was fun. Hey, now that I'm about done with my beer, it's time to go sign things. So come with me. Come on. Oh my god. Fox Mulder. That was amazing. <gasps> You're not Fox! Who are you? My name's, um, uh, what? Is this one Raphael? Is it Raphael? Raphael! Is this one Raphael? Yeah.